Hi, everyone. Andy Granberg with Stuart Title. With me, as always, is... Nate Moline. How's it going, Andy? It's going pretty well. How are things up in Duluth? They're going great. Uh, it's a balmy negative four out today, so that's Jeez. fun. Whoa, that's rough. Um, yeah. I'm down here in the posh downtown Minneapolis office of Stuart Title, and we are I here... See that. You like that? How about the view? Yeah, huh? the, the view is great. It almost looks like you put it... Put something up behind the window, or you got a blue screen back there, or something. Well, you know, the millions of dollars we spend on our on our, our uh, podcast here, uh, right. well worth it. Well worth it. Anyway, we're here today to help out agents, to help out real estate agents get more business, get more customers, get more listings. Nate, does that sound about right to you? Yeah, that sounds good to me. Let's do this. All right. My first idea for a real estate agent is after you have a buyer, they close, they're super happy with you, they're super happy with their new home, they're proud of it, um, throw them a housewarming party. And why is that, Nate? You want to get the community involved. It, if anything, like you can invite your neighbors, basically everyone to the housewarming. It benefits the, the buyers that just moved into the house. It'll benefit you to get your name out there even more so in the neighborhood. That's it's right. A great idea. They're going to invite their friends, their family, everyone. They're going to want to show off. They're proud of their brand new house and they're gonna introduce you as the real estate agent that did a fabulous job. Yeah, made their dream come true. That's very true. And it's not that much money either, so, and you should do something nice for your for your buyer. Um, it's just something you should definitely, definitely do. Um, it also goes to keeping in touch with your, with your customers. Um, they're not gonna forget that. Uh, National Association of Realtors, Nate, what is that statistic that we keep throwing out there about remembering your customers? Or remembering what your was customers? it? I think I think it was like 70% of new homeowners don't remember their the agent they used. Was it six months after they, six bought, their after property? they bought the home? Yeah, exactly. It's crazy. Yep. So another th takeaway is always keep in touch with people. It's very, very important. Nate, what's a good way to keep in touch with people? Well, I was just kind of going to add on to your, um, your housewarming party. Like that's a great way to do it in, especially like in Minnesota, let's say you sell a property to someone in the winter. They're not going to want to have a housewarming party in February. It's a great way to stay in contact with people like in, come June, July and be like, yep, now we're going to have a grill out at, in your backyard. It's going to be awesome. It'll give you time to kind of settle down into your house, That's um, kind of move in, get everything ready. And then once July comes, here's a huge party we'll have for all your friends, neighbors, anyone that you haven't really met in the neighborhood that you would like to meet type of a thing. Like, it's a really good way to stay in touch with someone six months after you close with them. Um, I like, I want to give that idea more credit than it is than our thirty seconds that we were giving it. That's all I'm saying. <laughs> that sounds like fun. I wish I would get invited to something like that. I know, right? Man. Gosh, um, what I did want to say, Nate, you have a great idea about keeping in touch with the agents um, using technology, which we do like to push on this show. Correct. Uh, that's always something we want to stay on the on the brink of, you know. Cutting edge, really. Yeah, the cutting edge. That's yeah. what I'm looking for. Yeah. So, what, what um, idea? <laughs> so, so one thing that I want to kind of push a little bit more is our Stuart Now app has this awesome technology where it will, when you farm a neighborhood, when you sell your house, you want to send out just sold labels to everyone in the neighborhood. Um, that is one thing that our Stuart Now app lets you do super easily it'll give you all the houses within like a depending on how close the houses are together but let's say uh, 300 houses in the neighborhood it'll send out the or it'll give you a hot list of houses that are most likely to sell and then you can get it out into uh, printing labels and you can just print out straight ahead shipping labels for all those houses so you can just put them to your um, flyer that says just sold X amount above asking price. Final and it's just, exactly, it's it's just a really great tool to kind of stay in touch with everyone. So like um, it. that's kind of my quick um, technology thing of the day. Is the Stuart Now app has a ton of stuff that um, we didn't really go over last time we talked about. Nate, how would they get in touch with you to obtain the Stuart Now app? Well, I, I personally, I love it when people contact me straight through Facebook, Facebook Messenger, um, post on my, um, on the Stuart um, of Minnesota Facebook page. Otherwise, you can always call, email me. My email address is just nate.moline at stuart.com. Um, otherwise, just 
comment below this video. I'll get in touch with them ASAP. Sounds good. All right, everyone. Thank you so much for joining us. Uh, Nate, have a great weekend. Yeah, you too, Andy. I'll All see right, you later. Bye-bye.